Hello everybody, I'm the Trabox Gamer and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. It's a level 1 run. Today we'll be off to Hollow Bastion and I'm checking the journal. We've completed most of it. It's just, I think one of the reports is tied to, you know, like the Sephiroth fight and I don't think I'm going to be able to beat his ass. And then there's the Heartless and some of them, no, no, some of them are too... They're a little too violent for my liking. Oh well, technically, we don't need to complete the journal. We just need to seal every keyhole. I think that's all we really need to do on the proud difficulty, so... Really, it's not that bad, but today we're off to fight another secret boss. Only this one's kind of a... Uh, this one's a little tricky. I mean, granted, unlike Sephiroth, he does have a technique that you could use on him to kind of beat him easily. It takes me a couple times to do it, and I've decided that I'm not going to skip anything, but I'm going to fast forward through the attempts just, just to get through it. Are you sure you're okay? No, I'm fine. I'm just feeling a little burnt out. Like, honestly, if this were any other playthrough... I just skipped to where I actually beat the fucker. But since it's a level 1 one, I feel like I'm obligated to show the attempts. Even if they're fast forward. Kind of like the gummy ship building when I, you know, fast forward through them. Okay, but that's more of a waste of time than doing anything, really. Okay, yeah, granted, you do have a point with that. I think... I... I think everybody's already been in this guy, so... Yeah. Am I really dead last? Well, to be honest, this episode, the normal run already, you know, won. So I am last. Well, to be fair, you're only last by one episode, so it's no big deal, really. Hmm. Yeah, I guess. I mean, to be honest, it could have been a lot worse, like... We could have been like several episodes late. One's not that bad. Though I really tried to sync it all with each other. But then the God Run got bored. And then he went and completed on 24. And we were like, what? Still stuck on Hollow Bastion? Yeah, that sounds about right. Dora, are you alright? Oh, God. What the hell is that? Ha! <laughs> Felt like my whole being was messed with for a moment. I am Sam? You son of a bitch, what you doing here? supposed to mean <gasps> jeez what's your problem well Sora I don't think he's a good person oh what gave it away the black coat or him attacking me unprovoked I hate your cryptic words, sir. You know, say what you want about this boss fight, how fucking hard it is. The fucking theme is like on point with it. It's like, it's so dreadful. And before I forget, the method that I'm using, I learned it from Will JV2. Thanks for the guides. It really helps out. Speaking of which, I also did that for the final boss because I figured I was going to need it. You went and looked for a guide for the boss? Yeah. I didn't want to spend over two hours getting my ass beat. Okay, douche. I figured I'd look into it before I get a headache, you know? 
I'm pretty sure the normal run explained what you have to do. You think he did that, right? Well, I'm pretty sure he has. Like, that's his fucking job. Yeah, probably. Well, just in case he doesn't, which would be kind of weird. Basically, gravity fucks this guy over. Giving you a good chance to hit him, but if you fuck up like I do, you're screwed. Also, I just, like, suck at dodging this guy, like... I, okay. I know it's not showing now, but trust me when I say I'm gonna suck at dodging this guy. Like, those attacks, that attack... It gets me a lot. Kinda hate it. Well, I don't know, Sora. You're not getting hit now. <laughs> yeah, now. Just gotta get him in a lock. And if you're wondering why Don on a goop, like why I chose to summon, it's because he has this one bullshit move that only, you know, only pops up if Don on a goofy are near you. So cut out the middleman and get rid of Don on a goofy. Well, I guess I'll go fuck myself. Sorry, goofy. It's not you. It's this fucker. Damn it. Shit. I'm dead. Are you gonna fast forward through it now? Yep. I mean, this is gonna be, what, second attempt? I'm gonna at least try to keep track of the attempts, okay? You know, I kinda like seeing footage go this fast. <laughs> it's kind of kind of funny you're easily amused aren't you third attempt you're really keeping track of all the times you die really i mean to be honest i haven't been but for the attempts here i'll try to keep track why for shits and giggles really kind of i kind of just want a sick genie on this guy you know, like, just see how much damage he could do. Fuck. Four. You know what I don't care about? What do you don't care about? How long it takes to summon a goddamn summon? Like, this, the scene is unskippable. It's like... I'm not saying it's bad, but it's like... Five. It's kind of semi-irritating, you know? Like, when you have to see it every time. Six. God, that sucks. I get what you mean. Plus, um, little seven. Damn it. Little known fact is that, say you summon a summon, the fuckers are still technically moving. So, it can put you in a unfavorable position. Granted, they don't move much, but they can do an attack. So, you gotta be careful. This part fucking killed me once. That's the only reason why I brought out fucking Dumbo. God damn it, eight. I am keeping track of correctly, am I? I don't know. You're the one counting. Damn. See, that's the move I was talking about. Nine. I hate that move. I feel like there's always that one boss with that one bullshit move. And like, it's an instant kill move, and it's all like the biggest motherfucker in the entire game. Like, fuck you, I could beat you if you didn't do that one fucking move. You know? Like, it'd be one thing if the boss was challenging, but if the boss is, like, cheap, get the fuck out of here. What was that, 10? What's the worst boss you ever had to deal with? If I have questions about that, do you mean like it's too easy? Is it too difficult? Either or, really? Because, you know, if a boss fight is too easy, it's like, why Why were you a boss? Why were you a boss? 
if it's too difficult where you know you have to exploit the game i, I mean would this be counting would this count as exploiting the game 11 i mean how, let me rephrase it if you have to use a cheap tactic it's wait is this a cheap tactic I wouldn't say so. I mean, one, you already have a deep buffer on you for being the first fucking level of the game. Not like you could level up or anything. Okay, yeah, good point. Two, they clearly... 12. Thank you. Two, they clearly, in, like, intended you to fight him this way if he's that damaged by, you know, gravity. Okay, yeah. That's a good point. If they added to the game, it has to be intended. Unless it's an oversight. 13. But, you know, with this boss, you could beat him without using this technique. God Run kind of proved that point, but 14. It kind of goes against, like, it's not a cheap boss because you could win without a cheap tactic. I, I guess. I, I'd say that the mysterious figure from Birth by Sleep would be a little cheap because you have to beat him. Well, I've seen people beat him without using the tactic, but it's still bullshit how... 15. Fire Search, Thunder Search, like, feels like it's the only way that you could beat them. But I've, I've seen other people do it without that method, and it's like, damn, that is impressive. I think I've seen someone kind of beat them with, like, Peter Pan, and I, I think they said that it crashes the game if you try to use that method with Peter Pan, and I find it kind of funny. Ha! <laughs> uh. Peter Pan breaks the game. He's a real master of masters. God damn, I hate that move. I'm surprised I got out of it. Fuck. Alright. That was 16 deaths. This is the 17th attempt. I would have laughed if it went to 13. I would have laughed if we managed to beat it on 13. It would have been so fitting. What's up with the number 13? I don't know. That's Namora or something. Also, 17, so this is 18th attempt. And this is the one where we live on. Are you sure about that? I'm positive. I did say his name right, though, right? What are you waiting for? Just waiting for him to do that. But yeah, I did say his name right. I'm pretty sure I pronounced it right. Right? I'm sure you have. I'm not, like, I'm not sure... But I'm pretty sure you have. I hope I have. I don't want to sound disrespectful. Jesus Christ, you overthink too many things. Just fight the damn boss already. Alright, alright. You know, <laughs> maybe this is why gravity is not in the sequels. This version of Ansem remembered it, and he's like, No, no, that's too powerful. Send him to Castle Oblivion. Make him forget everything. Spoiler, Sora. Oh, please, with a name like Castle Oblivion, what do you think's gonna happen? Death. I mean, yeah, you could have died. Hell, there's a lot of moments in this game where we could have died. But it seems like somebody didn't really... Take the opportunity. Am I right, Ansem? Can you just imagine that they're all sitting in their little office and they're all like, we could have killed him. We could have killed him if we just took him a little more seriously, but no. You said he wasn't a problem. You ignored him. Now look what happened. That would be it, yeah. If you think about it, we've been kind of a problem since Kingdom Hearts 1. <laughs> Uh, what did he, he, Ansem, uh, quote unquote Ansem, which I know I'm not technically right, but with the game's context, I am technically also right, said that Sora was what, just an ordinary boy or some shit like that? Thank you, whoever healed me. Thank you guys, you're on it. I fucked up. I, I don't know, like, he wasn't... I just remember he was saying that he's not that impressive, and yet he's the one that disrupts your plans all the time. Maybe if you didn't put a blind eye to him, you would have been a okay. See, 
I think that's just a gross fuck. That is, however, a gross summary of what happened. So don't take it literal, okay? Plus, I am trying to avoid as many spoilers as possible. Well, you're doing a shitty job by that. I think you pretty much spoiled some things. We're the main hero. We have to win. Good guys always win in these stories, you fucker. Oh, right. I guess you're right on that part. Newsflash. Protagonist wins. Main character beats bad guy. How shocking. Okay, story. You don't have to be a dick about it. Whoa! Hey! We actually got him. You sound so surprised when you know you damn well edit this. I know. I just decided to take a little longer. I thought it'd take a lot longer. Add this to the people you murdered, Sora. Oh, please. It wasn't murder. It was self-defense. What the fuck? He denied death. He's also omnipresent. Omnipotent. You were right the first time, Goofy. Sora, send this motherfucker to the death dimension. Right, right, right. Gotcha. Death dimension, really? What? I can't say. Uh, I don't know. Joke's on you. I'm omnipresent. I know what you're talking about. What is he talking about? Spoilers, Sora. Wait, what are you? <gasps> Anybody else feel like he's about to say, I am your father? You said that before, too. <laughs> I know, it just, it feels so fitting. It's like, I am your father. Like, the look on Sora's face, it's like, it would be fitting if he dropped that bombshell on him. Oh, yeah, that's going to be very useful for me. Thanks. You don't have to be a dick about it. <laughs> I know. I'm just stating the fact that experience necklace is going to be very useful for me. All right? Let's get the hell out of here. Why don't you run? You're never going to be in this room again. I want to take the moment to enjoy it. All right? And sadly, there's no vines to climb. So, yeah. If there were vines, i climb all over them. What the fuck is wrong with you? What? I like to climb on the vines during the boss fight. You are a simpleton, you know that? Well, you see, we can't go back. Alright? And before I forget, yeah, no, we're not ending it here. We're going back to Merlin. This part was actually supposed to be for the last episode, the very beginning of the last episode. But I decided, you know, it's a small enough part. We can just include it in here. Why are we going back to Merlin? We forgot to grab Donald's Dream Rod. Please rephrase. Please rephrase. Please. We forgot to grab Donald's weapon, you fucking pervert. Uh, I don't know. You said we're going to grab Donald's Dream Rod. The only kind of Dream Rod I could think of is... Alright! I get it. Jesus Christ, Goofy. Good of magic. I think it's the only thing that's good with magic. I mean, the best at magic, unless I get... Ah, oh, fuck, I can't do that because it's synthesis. Gotcha, never mind. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time. Take care, and please, like and subscribe.